guys, welcome back to Seven Oaks. Today, I'm gonna to try and put my first log on this thing, but first, I'm gonna install this diesel drip that I got from Cook's. I don't have water out here, which I could get water, but I decided to use diesel anyway to start with, and we'll see. I know that's a lifelong debate made a mistake of putting a post up on one of the forums about diesel versus water versus pine saw versus whatever. And man, there were some people pretty passionate about their lube. But we're gonna go this route. I got a 40 or a 30 gallon tank over there for the tractor full of diesel. And with this puppy right here, I guess that doesn't take a whole lot and uh, run one tank for quite a quite a while so all right already I don't know what I'm doing let's get all this apart that's probably something I need yes sir. all right so this is what was in the box I got some directions which I'm definitely gonna need. I usually don't use directions, but in this case, I got a felt pad, some kind of little odd piece of metal there, and a little valve with the glass on it and a filter. Now, this can't be too bad, or can it? All right, super drip system is a universal drip system. I'm not going to read the whole thing. I just hit the high points. Felt holder bracket and the drip line holder are welded to the head frame. It's a typical way to mount your holder system. If you're not able to have it welded on, then bolting the felt bracket is an option. The drip line will need to sit over the felt so that the fluid can be absorbed by the felt. Okay, so it looks like they welded it on right here. I don't know if you can see that. That's what it needs to look like in the end. So, Helps if you turn the key on. Really dressed to weld today. I didn't know this was a weld on park. Go ahead and put a blade on there. It's the first time I put a blade on it. Try not to cut myself. Time for everything, guys.
I can see getting cut with these. I can see that happening. Okay, hopefully we won't have a follow-up video, what am I doing wrong video. God darn, spider webs are terrible. Alright, so that's on there. That's on there. Super. Good there, I'll tighten it up. It doesn't look like the tension's right on this. So. Alright, so the end of this bolt right here, when this is at full tension, should line up with that orange seal right there, that orange ring. I could tell when I tightened it up. Went the wrong way. I could tell when I tightened it up there was hardly any tension on it at all. Righty tighty. We're getting better, still got a good ways. <laughs> right in line with that orange ring there okay so we got the blade on let's see if we can finish welding this up so you can see right there this is the bracket right here and I got a little bit of clearance right there between the blade and that bracket so I can finish welding that the rest of the way up And put the felt pad in, put the rest of it all together here. Got that welded on there. Alright. Pad. Shim. And this is gonna go down in there. I'm probably gonna cut it off. Yep. Cut that off and save it. Save that piece. This in there. Down on the blade. Run that down in there. This is kind of wet wedges in there. Use it not to tension it. Right there.
That should be about right. Really could use my Dremel right now. Get in that little spot right there. Just trying to or a file. Just trying to get some of this paint off, so I got something to weld to. Welding over top of paint. Even though it's nothing structural, I don't want it to stand. There you go, that should work. The picture is a little different. It looks like the machine they're putting it on is a little different than this one. But where there's a will, there's a way. That should work right there. Just like that. Give you a look here. Okay, so we're not gonna put that on the rate my weld uh, social media page, but it's not gonna come off. I can tell you that. All right, so we'll come around. Um, let me just see here. In there for a second. I'm gonna let that cool down probably before I stick this through there. It should be. And that's gonna sit just like that, guys. That ought to work. Drips the diesel on that pad. Pad puts the diesel on the blade. Done deal. Stick that right in there. This ends up having to go into here somehow. Probably. This has to be vertical. Well, 
All right, it's temporary for now. Temporary forever. That should work, though. No reason why it shan't. There on that. Yep. It's perfect. All right. Let's put some diesel in this thing and fire it up. down there, right guys? That's the only thing that makes me nervous. Things are awesome too, by the way. If anybody uses these, but great. Working. I'll throw a log on here in a minute. Here's the drip. I'll have to fool with that and see what the optimum speed is or rate for that drips per second. Probably like one drip every two or three seconds that would get. Tank's leaking somewhere. Okay, so I think I found a problem here. I wasn't really thinking about it, but I think you have to have your longer tube on top and your shorter tube on the bottom because you don't want that much fluid in there you know, when you shut it off for the day, it's going to eventually drain all that fluid out. You want to have a shorter distance, I think, from your drip to your pad, so you're only losing like this much at a time. And I got it the other way around.
All right, I got it better now. I've got it still temporarily wired up, but now I'm only controlling this much diesel. And this thing was kind of hard to bleed. You got to just pump this to get all the air pushed back out so it'll start siphoning. Um, but like I said, this is my first time ever doing any of this, so hopefully you'll learn from my mistakes. I'm going to go grab a log, throw it up on here and see how that goes. Stay with me. So thanks for watching guys. I'm going to put a link up here to the next video. I split it in two because it was just a little bit too long. So stay with me and if you like this kind of stuff, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. It really helps grow the channel. Thank you.